Well, here's attempt number two with Gallagher Smart Fence and the pigs. A couple days ago, I put the fence on the inside of poultry netting, electrified poultry netting, so that they wouldn't go through it. And this morning, I took the netting away. So as you can see, the pigs are totally enclosed by four strands of Gallagher Smart Fence. It seems to be quite effective so far. They, I haven't even seen them get too close to it, but it's doing its job and this uh, just shows that you got to properly train pigs to electric fence and it's a great tool. In the back I've also, let's see, there's a couple stumps back here. I'm trying to walk between two fences without getting shocked. Yeah, right there. There's a stump right there with the sprouts coming out of it. I took a crowbar and put a couple holes down on the ground next to it and put some cracked corn down there for them to root and hopefully eventually turn that stump up. But we'll see how well that works. The last weekend, or a few days ago, when I was putting this fence on the inside of the poultry netting, this gate here was closed and I was reaching over. I totally forgot about this top wire I put up here. I reached over and that touched the inside of my armpit and holy crap, that did not feel good. So again, if you missed it the first time, there's the water. It's a quick disconnect on the inside and it's filled about a third full of water so they don't move it around. And it's a Brower mineral feeder that I fill up with their, uh, their pellets for free choice feed.